everyone welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be doing a clothing haul which is something i've not done in such a long time and um, so i've got some really nice pieces from Primark, h&m and new look um, i'm going to do a try on as well so you can see how they look on my body um, and yeah i'm really excited it's been such a long time since i've been able to do a big clothing shop just because it's not been in the budget for the last few months um, so i was really excited yesterday to go to newcastle and um, have a shop around try things on and I'm really happy with what I got so a bit of background firstly my body type I am uh, five foot so I'm very short um, I'm a size 14 to 16 I've got quite a large chest um, and I'm also eating better um, and doing more fitness so my body is changing I am finding that I am losing little bits of weight and um, here and there so um, yeah that's kind of you know my body and then what I was looking for is um, just some really nice basics I'm trying to create more of a capsule wardrobe because I love colour I love the current trends but I find that my wardrobe is just chaotic and um, I struggle to pair things together and you know make outfits and yeah I just wanted some nice kind of staple pieces for my wardrobe and also things that I could wear during summer but layer up for autumn and winter um, because I want these clothes to last. Um, I'm going on a summer holiday in October, so not anytime soon. So again, I want things that I can wear then, but also the week after when I'm back at home and it's probably horrible weather. Um, so yeah, that was the plan. I've got myself a cup of tea. I've got one of my Bath & Body Work candles on in the background and I'm just feeling like so cosy and excited um so yeah let's get into it so starting off with h&m which isn't my usual go-to shop we don't have one in my town so i don't often shop there and i don't really like shopping online because of their sizing so first up we have a little bag so this was in the sale for six pound and um, it should have been 15 and i just really like the color it's like a really nice kind of tan brown and um, i don't have a lot of little handbags but i do want to develop like a colorful collection so that if i'm Dressing quite neutrally I can accessorize and add a pop of color with like a little handbag or a hair clip or jewelry and um, so that's the plan anyway and um, so yeah I've got this little bag which I absolutely love so I should probably point out that I do have eczema on my chest which I am working on getting rid of because the only reason it's as bad is because I'm a picker so when I'm anxious I like pick my skin and um, so I'm working on getting rid of this but I felt like if I got tops that are lower cut obviously they're more flattering for my body type especially having like a larger bust um but i normally tend to get higher neck options because i don't like how my chest looks like the eczema so as i said i'm working on getting rid of it and i thought if i get tops that i like in styles that i like but obviously do show my chest then maybe it'll motivate me not to pick but we'll see how that goes anyway i love this top i thought i'll just show you everything as i try it on this was a tempo 99 i got a large um it's like a really nice charcoal gray um and it's got like a darker detailing with the stitching i feel like this is a very like trendy top especially because of the detail really in fashion at the minute but i definitely think that it would continue to be a staple because it's just a nice charcoal gray top um and i really like the neckline um and yeah i just think it's really flattering it is a bit shorter but it's not i wouldn't say too cropped like it covers like my belly button area so i feel like obviously i wouldn't have to tuck this in um jeans but if i had like really high waisted jeans on i could tuck it in and um, i feel like i could wear it like with joggers and things as well and yeah i just really love the color um and the fit like i feel like it's very flattering so that's the first one okay this is the next top this one was 12.99 i um this is actually a bodysuit i firstly got this in a large but when i tried it on there was quite a lot of excess material at the size so i've actually sized down to a medium which means it's a little bit more snug um but like i said i shouldn't be gaining any more weight if anything i should maybe just um lose a little bit so, because it means it fits me now but if i did lose a little bit of weight it should still fit my body and um, but yeah i just really love the neckline of this one it's just a really nice staple black top and um, it's more of like a ribbed detail um and yeah i just think it's really pretty obviously i've got it on with my jeans at the minute which i think looks really nice and yeah as i said i just think this is really flattering and um, that's actually everything from h&m i did try on more things but i didn't buy everything and um, so next i am going to go on to new look 
So sticking with bodysuits, this bodysuit is from New Look. Um, New Look is one of my favourite shops to go to. We've got one in our town, so it's really accessible for me. Um, but I've always found New Look sizing okay for me. And I feel like it's good quality, yet still quite affordable. So it's my go-to shop usually for fashion anyways. Um, so I absolutely love this bodysuit. I love animal print. Um, again, I wouldn't normally choose, um, like I wouldn't choose sleeveless top but it's just so warm at the minute and I just feel so much more free and I'm trying to just kind of accept that yeah my arms are a little bit bigger but it's fine and um, again with my chest but I quite like the neckline of this one and um, it's obviously not showing too much um, cleavage but I would say it is flattering for my body type and um, it's a bodysuit I've not I clasped it and um, so it does go a bit tighter and um, but yeah I just really loved the print and the detailing because it's got like some gold buttons here and I just think this will be really pretty again um, wear it in um, you know summer with some jeans or some shorts but in winter and autumn I could imagine like pairing it with a chunky cardigan and some boots and things so I definitely think this is going to be one um, that I can wear all year round and yeah I just think very flattering really like it it hides my bra straps really well because obviously it's thicker at the top and um, which i like obviously having a larger bust usually my bra straps are a little bit thicker um but yes yeah, so i'm really happy with this one i don't know if i said but it was 19.99 um and it's got like a ribbed detailing as well so i just really love the quality of this one don't know if I said, but this top was in a 16. Um, I could have probably got a 14, but I just liked how this one fit. Um, for the next one, I'm going to have to move you down a little bit because this is a skirt and I want you to see it as much as possible. Um, so this is a really pretty like olive green satin skirt. I love a satin midi skirt. Um, I got my first one last year. Like I never would have thought being a petite person um that i would suit long skirts and long dresses but i actually think i do and i really love wearing them as well um like with a pair of vans or trainers or even sandals again dress it up and dress it down in different seasons um, and I just love this colour I think it's a really nice staple piece obviously it's not a neutral colour but it is more neutral than like the other ones I've got which are like pink and blue um, and yes I just really love it it's very flattering I got it in a size 14 um, I think this one was 25 99 so a little bit pricier than the other items I've got but I will keep this literally forever and it will be a staple in my wardrobe um, and yeah I just love it I think it's really flattering I'll just move back a little bit more obviously it's not the easiest to show um, but yeah I just love wearing a midi skirt because I think it just obviously drapes down nicely um, and I really like the colour and I think it goes well with this top as well um, but I would also wear it with like white and black tops too so yeah really like this one i'll keep the camera low down for this one so this is a dress which i got in a size 14 i can't actually remember how much it was 12.99 so 13 pound um again in like a really nice khaki green um and this is like a kind of knee length on me um you can't really see that so it's knee length and it is just like a really nice plain dress which is obviously sleeveless but it has the thicker straps again and i just really like this one it's just very basic very plain i think it'd look really nice in summer with a denim jacket and some sandals um and yeah i just thought this would be a nice staple piece um that i could wear especially like on my summer holiday but this season as well at home i don't know how i'll dress it for autumn and winter because i don't necessarily know if it would go with tights but if anyone has any um, ideas do let me know but yeah i just really loved it like this is definitely not the kind of dress i would normally buy myself because obviously it does highlight my stomach a little bit but as i said with like a little jacket on you wouldn't even see anyways um and i've just put some like little shorts on underneath as well uh, but yeah it's really comfy really good quality i did see similar ones in pre-mark i don't know how much they were um, but the quality wasn't as nice so i'm glad that i picked this up i got this in a 14 i actually tried it on in the shop as a 16 and i'm really glad that i went back and got the smaller size because there's actually still room in here as well so yeah it's just gonna be a really nice dress that'll hopefully um obviously fit me for a long time and just be a staple um especially for summer just having a tea break <laughs> i've put 
got this one on back to the front so moving on to pre-mag another favorite of mine obviously just because it is so affordable um so firstly i've got this little white top um a similar style to the brown one that i had on at the start of the video um again obviously it does show my arms but i definitely think this is just so much better for um summer when it is warmer and obviously you know i would probably wear a jacket most times on top anyways um but yeah just a really nice white basic top i think it's not very see-through and wearing like a grey bra and you can't really see it obviously if you're wearing like a pink bra then you probably would um but i do think like the quality is really nice considering it was only five pound i got it in a size large um again it is like short like i wouldn't say it's really cropped i mean it depends obviously on your figure but there were some things that were literally like i don't even think they would go past my bra um you know some of the trends at the minute are just not for my body type and um, so it is shorter but i quite like this because it's not too short um but it means that i wouldn't have to like try and tuck it into my jeans or joggers like it would just sit quite nicely and i tried this on with some little cycling shorts which are in gray they were at three pound which i thought was really good but i actually just got these to go under midi skirts and midi dresses i wouldn't just wear like this outfit on its own i mean i'd probably wear like a longer baggier top with some cycling shorts like that's obviously a cute look um but i don't think this is the most flattering but yeah like i said i just got these to go under skirts and dresses i thought for three pounds you can't go wrong obviously the top was five and they did have it in some other colors as well i also got these joggers which i'm just about to put on now and um, these are seven pound they're regular fit and i got them in a medium because i actually have the exact same joggers in a large and they were really comfy but i didn't realize how baggy they were on my legs and obviously i am petite and these aren't exactly short so they did bunch up quite a lot at the bottom and um, so yeah i've just got them in a medium instead i'll probably still keep the large but if i was going out i would much prefer to wear the medium so i'm just gonna pop them on now obviously you can't see so that that's fine um and i will just quickly show you against this top put my little slippers back on god i'm like getting out of breath from trying on all these clothes and then i want to try them on again later on because it's a bit dull at the minute so when it's brighter i want to try them on and get some nice pictures on the landing in my mirror um so these are the joggers <sighs> i really have no space awareness today uh, but yeah i just think they are really flattering and just a really lovely color they're so comfy and cozy i might even go and get another pair just so i've got them just in case anything happens to these ones because these are literally like my favorite joggers ever and i just love the color as well it's just a really nice kind of light gray um did i say they were seven pound i think i did yeah so they were the joggers uh, i'm gonna try on another t-shirt so this top was £5, I got it in a size large and I just think definitely a basic and good for a capsule wardrobe. Um, I've literally been looking for a striped top for such a long time but again just not found one that is flattering for my body and I think with stripes as well it's hit or miss. Um, I really love this, it's got some little buttons, obviously it's like a nice like circular neck and I just think it fits really well again. It is quite short um not too cropped but again like i wouldn't have to tuck it in but if i wanted to i could because when you have long tops tucking them in is literally so annoying um but yeah i just really love this um and again just you know really good for summer with some little shorts and sandals but then in autumn and winter i think i could just chuck on a chunky cardigan um, and it'd look really nice as well i think the stripes are like a navy and um, they did have some similar ones with black stripes the only thing is sometimes i think like with h&m and Primark especially is the sizes that i go for i feel like sell out really quickly um i've actually just recently bought some dresses from morrison i'm going to do another fashion haul at some point um and i got a dress in a 14 which as i said i'm a 14 to 16 so the fact that i even fit in the 14 i was like buzzing but it was even too big so i actually need a size 12 which i've not been a size 12 in years um and i need to go back i've been like james has been to both morrison's 
in our town and there's been no 12s so i feel like sometimes just certain sizes sell out and there was a few striped tops that i seen in h&m and primark that weren't in my size which i did like but i'm really happy with this one to be honest so it was clearly meant to be um so yeah really happy with that i also bought a bag so this is just a nice black bag from primark this one was seven pound i actually have a really similar one without like this detailing that i use like nearly every day it's like a real staple in my wardrobe i wear it all the time however macy's chewed the back of um, the strap and I just know that it's like getting to the end of its life like it is really well used so I thought I would get this one because like I said it's gonna you know be a staple and I just really loved this pattern they had it in cream as well which I thought was so pretty but I don't have a lot of cream clothes and like I feel like if you had matching sandals or something that would look really good but I often wear black fans and it just goes really well with those but obviously like black sandals as well so I really really love that it's quite good quality as well like I really love like the puffy detailing so that was seven pound okay last one this top was six pound I got it in a size large and it's like a really nice kind of light bluey grey like a bit of an unusual colour which I really like Um, I really like this like ruching detail I feel like ruching is very flattering for my figure and having a larger chest Um, and obviously you can adjust it as well so I think it looks quite cool with my joggers but also it would go with jeans Um, I wish that this area was like a little bit thicker um, but to be honest it's not too much of an issue and I can imagine wearing this on holiday um, and yeah I just think it's a really nice flattering top so yeah really happy with that I think I have done really well it's been a long time since I had a successful shopping trip because normally I pick things up that I like and then I try them on and I'm like no um I was telling the girls that I went shopping with um so last year me and Jess went shopping Jess is my sister she's 18 oh my god is she 18 or 19 i think she's 18 um and she's like the cooler trendier one she you know is the prettier one it's like actually really annoying but um i really love how she dresses and we had went to new look and premark in town and i got her to pick things for me to try on and i really liked everything and it was really surprising because these items of clothing weren't things that I would pick up because I didn't think I would suit them um, and ever since I do feel like I've been com more confident with my like outfit choices Um, I think obviously being curvier and struggling with my body quite a lot like I would often choose baggy tops and things to hide my figure whereas what I've realized is things like this which are actually tight and show my stomach um, make me look slimmer anyway so to be honest I think I was just making myself look worse by choosing the baggy clothes like you do need to wear what you're comfortable in and what you like but sometimes pushing yourself out of your comfort zone can be a really good thing because now I feel more comfortable in things like this as opposed to a baggy top um, and I really like the style of them as well so it's just like a win-win really I'm not like 100% body confident but I am getting better um, and I've actually asked Jess to do a shopping order for me with a budget of £50 and I'm going to do like a little i don't know if it's a pretty little thing that she's bought things off because she normally buys from there they do like a sister did my clothing shop kind of video and um, so that's gonna be fun so i'm excited to see what she got me so if you obviously like fashion content then do stay tuned for that um because i just basically told her the same as what i said like i told her my size that i do want more basics but i kind of like what she wears and obviously i am open to try different things but anytime that she has picked something for me to try on or has bought me things like for my birthday and stuff i've been really happy with it um, so that'll be coming soon um, I won't be doing large shopping hauls that often because um, truthfully I just do not have the money for it right now at least till um, next year where there. that's really loud um yeah so this kind of video is obviously rare for me but i do want to do more clothing hauls and fashion content um chances are i will be just doing like a smaller shop each month and um, so i might come on here and do a little haul and a try on so do let me know if that's something you would like to see um but yeah thank you for watching uh, i had a really great day yesterday i'm really happy with everything that i got i'm trying to work out how much i spent i mean you would have been able to work it out if you counted it up i think i must have spent about 120 to 
additional 130 on clothes which i don't think is too bad considering what i bought because like i said you know they're basics they're gonna do me for different seasons you like a broken record right now but i think for what i've got um i think the cost was actually really good um and i got some really nice outfits from it so yeah thank you for watching and i will see you in my next video